The main question this paper tries to answer is, can we localize touch over a complex three-dimensional surface? And if so, how can we build such a sensor while keeping it easy to manufacture and to integrate into robot hands? To answer this question, we take five tactile pressure sensors and embed them in a volume of soft material. Our overall objective is to localize touch over the three-dimensional surface of the tactile dome with high accuracy. Our key intuition is that configurations that favor crosstalk between the tactile sensors will provide better localization. If that is the case, then an indentation anywhere on the dome surface should produce a meaningful signal in all tactile sensors, allowing us to use this signature to determine the location of the indentation. Our approach is purely data-driven. This means that we want to find a mapping between the five tactile sensor readings to the location on the surface of the dome where touch has occurred. We collect data in a controlled fashion to learn this mapping, using a kernel ridge regressor. Now, a purely data-driven approach like ours opens up an important question. How do we place the sensors inside the dome to achieve good localization accuracy? Because the design space is so large, we need to rely on our intuition to select candidate designs. Here, we see the 10 candidate designs that we explored in this paper. They span two distinct sensor distributions and multiple mounting angles for the tactile sensors. We create a simulated model for all 10 candidate designs and generate synthetic datasets that are then used to train the machine learning algorithm. This allows us to test and predict the final localization performance of each given design. Our best designs show millimeter level localization accuracy over a three-dimensional surface of 1300 millimeters square. Case 1 and Case 8 were selected to be physically built for validation purposes. We found that the localization performance of our physical domes came very close to what was predicted by our simulations. In conclusion, our data-driven method produces a sensor capable of high-accuracy contact localization over three-dimensional surfaces. We believe this method can be used to deploy tactile sensing capabilities with improved coverage and few wires over complex surfaces such as a robotic finger or palm.